Hey. <laughs> um, I'm just outside. <sighs> Drinking my smoothie. Mm. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to talk about, but I'll start off with sharing what's in my smoothie. So, um, it's really good. It's this bright yellow color. It tastes as good as it looks. I have to go to work in a little bit. But, um, so this smoothie has one fresh mango, very ripe, and one really, really ripe banana. Super sweet and yummy. And then I put probably about two cups of ice, if not more. And then, um, like, uh, juice of two grapefruits. And then, uh, probably about a tablespoon or more of bee pollen, local. And I just blended it all together. I always add a lot of ice to get this like really nice consistency. But yeah. <clears throat> oh, puppy. Go play. Go play. Sir. Okay. <clears throat> so, anyway. Stupid interruptions. Huh. So, basically, I just um, have been grounding myself today by um, Working in the garden and planting some plants. So I think that's what I want to share with you today. I'm going to go ahead and go over there and show you. <clears throat> it felt really good to, you know, get my hands dirty and really just connect with you know the land so close to my to myself anyway so planted a oh, hibiscus lovely blooms strawberry plant bush vine i don't know what that's going to be Marigolds, lavender, this is like cat grass or something like that, some mint, and um, some more marigolds, some more mint, and garden's like at the birthing phase, so here's, um, get out of the light, the sage, raspberry, Poppy, let's see, uh, orange mint, little baby tree, um, Rosemary some more, I think. Yes, more. And then this one down here, I think, was pineapple sage. Yes, I'm very excited to try this baby. <clears throat> so, yeah. <laughs> that is what I planted in the garden today um let's see going to Sedona for the weekend I'm really really excited my best friend Gilbert 
and staying a really cute bed and breakfast place. I think that we're gonna go on a Jeep tour and um I'm really excited. <sighs> I've been thinking a lot about relationships and stuff as well today. Um just kind of grasping the fact that I don't need anyone in my life. Um, I just need to focus on myself. And um, it's hard because, you know, as a human, we have these needs and wants and desires and stuff to be happy. And our mind tricks herself into believing that um, we love someone when really we're just attached to them and we um, are attached to the feeling that they give us. Because a lot of the times, you know, they say opposites attract, but um, they should really say needs attract because, you know, one person might be lacking something, the other person might have a lot more of that to give, so just like, read a really interesting article on it today by Teal Scott and I'll post it in the link in the description for you to read because, um, she goes into it much better than I could. I, I can talking about it. So it's basically it. Nice and short, too simple. Um. So yeah. Love you. Go in peace. Have a wonderful day.